What's up guys, it's Alex and G Pike. People call me Alex. And in today's video, I'm going to be reading the sixth and final episode of Come Find Me, this gay text message story. So let's get started. Alan, so have you figured out what you're doing, going to do yet? Ben, I have a few things up my sleeves. They better not be Shakespeare's sonnets or end where they're playing with something romantic on the ukulele. Shock face. No, dude! That's worse than the flash mob! First of all, who doesn't love a flash mob? I don't. Second of all, it's only my backup plan. I think the flash mob is like paparazzi. I'm not sure, but it has the word flash. I cannot watch Flash Nights, so I do not, not like anything with Flash Nights unless if I'm home, which that's stupid. Because of my seizures, I'm not allowed to watch Flash Nights because it just makes me dizzy. It has a trigger. But whenever I'm home, and now I'm going to stay home, I'll watch Flash Nights and I'll get dizzy. You are a fucking apocalyptic chick flick hot mess. By the way, the Flash Mob is complaining there are no snacks. And is there a cutoff time here that we give up? I don't want to think about giving up. Just tell them. Pizza's on me after we're done. Dude. You didn't even have money for a diner eh, hamburger the, the last time I saw you. I will worry about that this shit later. I can't feel my feet right now. Shit, she's coming. Lainey opened the door and asked, get off of me, if she looked okay. Ben just smiled. She looked beautiful. So beautiful. For a moment, he forgot about Steve Mitchell. A little bit later, Lainey. So, I'm here, and I'm really, really nervous. D, why are you nervous? It's not like you have to worry about what to say to him. Just speak, and once he'll understand. Not funny. Seriously, though? If this is the dude who has been leaving you leaving clues, you could probably greet him with a kick in the balls and be fine. Where's the neighbor? He's going to be get a spear. You know coming in with a dude makes it look like you're taken? Steve isn't even here yet. D ben, dude, are you there? Alan, giddy up! Shithead isn't here yet, and I just want to get a some beer and got side eyes from like eight different people before Madeline Cross said, Aren't you one of those band geeks? Yeah, dude. That shit is lit like the Scarlet Letter. Sorry, I was in a studio. Um, like I was saying, you'll never get rid of it until you leave town. Anyway, maybe he won't come. Um. Uh, okay. Anyway, maybe he won't come. Or maybe he'll. He's one of those people who just like gets high for four hours and shows up for the end. So what do I do now? Find a way to get beer. I spoke too soon. What? He just rolled in. Oh, shit. What are you going to do? She just walked up to him. Don't do the sonnets. Hello? Ben? I'm not. So then what's the plan? I'm just... I'm going to let her be. Um... I think... The sentence, so then what's the plan, is supposed to be for Alan, and then Ben is, was supposed to say, I'm just, I'm going to let her be. Yep. Wait, what? You know I'm leaving town, and if that's the guy she likes, he's going to be here. Might as well let her have happiness. That's the most pussy thing I've ever heard in my life. Yeah. Well, what else am I going to do? Can't force the, this. I'm already on the way way back to the car. But you don't even know if it's working out. I don't want to see it. A plastic wet cup of beer 
comes flying and hits him in the head. Oh, at least it was plastic. And now I'm covered in beer. Oh no, one of those pieces of shit threw beer at you. Are you close to the car? Not that close. Why? Because you're going to want to speed things up. I just called the cops. You what? Hey! I'm not a brat. <laughs> My mom's mean. <laughs> Fuck the cool kids. Their asses are gonna get busted. Ben, where, where did you go? Ben's eyes got wide. Why? I've been looking for you. It's not Steve. What do you mean? Just as I was talking about the clues, he looked at me like I had marshmallows growing out of my head. Then some idiot cheerleader from high school south, I, I think that's high school south, went up to him and practically shoved him her hands down in his... Th yeah, I was not expecting that. Um, I'm scarred. Parents in front of me. I want to get out of here. You were right. We should have gone to Mount Wilson. Do you think there's still time? I'm sure the person will still be there if that's the right place. Ben jumps up like he won the uh, Olympic gold. I did Special Olympics, like sports, and I got in a trophy for bowling and basketball, and then I smashed it because of my anger. Then suddenly, police sirens started sounding nearby. Holy shit! I think the cops are here. Ben had totally forgotten. Okay, stay calm. Come and meet me by my car. I don't remember where you parked. I was too nervous to pay attention. Just run towards the opposite direction of where we came in, and we can get around from there. I'll meet you by the cellar. Shit, shit, shit! What? I fell. I think I broke my ankle. You think you what? Hold on, I'm coming to get you. Oh, Prince Charming go going to do get his princess. <laughs> Two hours later. D, you are the clumsiest bitch I know. Don't rub it in. Um, ben totally saved me, though. The cops had just started flashing now. Flashlights. And he picked me up and went me out of the woods like he was saving me from the war. Where is he now? He's down in the hospital cafeteria getting me a muffin. So I guess you'll never find out who the clue guy is now? I guess not. You probably will. Are you bummed? I mean, I guess a little. But like you said, he was probably a hot mess. Weird. Someone just started blasting that in your eyes song from, say, anything in the hallway. I always wished someone would stand out my window holding a boombox like John Cusack, whatever. Okay, banal stuff I don't need to know. I'll be by to visit him out. Gotta watch me some Na Nashville before it's gone forever. Sh sure enough. As soon as Lainey put her phone down, someone reached into her room and turned out the lights. Another person walked in with a night sky projector throwing up stars all over the room. Yeah, she might be finding out who the person is. The music she heard from the hallway got louder and 12 others came in the room, dancing and lip-syncing to the song. The second- Ow! 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 The second it, it reached the first chorus, Ben walked into the room, holding up a big boombox. Lainey smiled. The clue came to her. They're so cute. That's the end of this series. If you like content like this, please hit the subscribe button, turn on our personal- Okay, hold on. Let me speak. English. Turn on all post notifications. Smash the thumbs up button. And I'll see you in the next video. Hit the subscribe. You know what to do. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.